I am powerful. I am healthy. I am strong. Uh, I am confident. Um, that's exactly what I am statements are made for. Now, when it comes to affirmation recordings, this doesn't this doesn't hold up true. Um, your subconscious mind does know the difference between whether you're stating something yourself or whether it's hearing somebody else, somebody else's voice. Um, in these circumstances, it's very beneficial for that to be a you are statement. And the reason for this is, since your subconscious does know the difference, it does know that is not you. All it hears, if you're, hear, if, if you're listening to a recording of somebody else's voice who is saying I am statements, your subconscious is saying, oh, that guy on, on the recording is powerful. That guy on the recording um, is healthy. That guy in the recording is strong. It isn't a personal statement. It is instead supposed to be, if it's a recording, it should be a you are statement. That, that is someone from the outside saying, you are strong. You are healthy. You are in control. See the difference there? This is very, this is, it matters when you're talking about recordings of affirmations. It matters if it's not your own voice. It should be a you are statement, not an I am statement. Um, if I'm listening to Tony Robbins say a bunch of I am statements, you know, my, my subconscious knows that's not you, that's somebody else talking about themselves. It's, your, your subconscious is not the same. So while you may go, well, I understand that to be, um, you know, it's supposed to be talking about me, your subconscious, it just hears that there's someone else talking about themselves. So in, in the case of recordings, you want to go with you are statements and not I am statements. I hope this is very helpful, guys. Um, let me know. Thanks.